Hello everybody. I want to do this video here today about a controversy that has just came up over another one of my videos. Please watch this video to the end. Give me your thoughts and opinions on it. Hit me up in the comments and let me know. But I did a video of a Ford flathead V8 motor, I called it, or I said it could be called an engine. And a lot of people commented on that telling me that it was not a motor, it was an engine that a motor ran off electricity and an engine was combustible. So it just got me to thinking. Around here, we've always called them a motor, but I have heard that all my life that a motor is electric. An engine runs off gasoline or diesel, some type of fuel, or even steam, the steam engine. But I just wanna ask a few questions here. Why is it called Ford Motor Company instead of Ford Engine Company. Do you ride a motorcycle or do you ride an engine cycle? Do you have a motor boat or do you have an engine boat? There was a magazine out. I don't know if it's still out. It may be, but it's a popular magazine. It used to be called Motor Trend. And it was about cars. It was not called Engine Trend. And it was not about electric motors. If you go to the parts store, and you buy those right there. They call those motor mounts. Also, back in the day, if you mess with cars all the time, everybody called you a motorhead. They did not call you an engine head. I actually looked up the term, definition for motor. Definition of motor. It says a machine, especially one powered by electricity or internal combustion that supplies motive power for a vehicle or some other device with moving parts. And it shows a pictures of motors or engines, whatever you want to call them there. But it, that is for a vehicle, for a car, truck. So to me, this can be a motor. It don't have to be an engine. But another thing I want to bring up and just show you is different types of oil. This is Napa brand. And what does it say right here? Motor oil. I'm pretty sure that's for a vehicle. I don't think you're supposed to pour that into an electric motor. Then we'll just come over here with a Harvest King. It also says motor oil. We've got pins oil. It says motor oil. We've got peak. It says motor oil. Then we come to Rotella. And it actually says heavy duty diesel engine oil. So by the oil, I'm taking it. If it's a gas burner, it's a motor. If it's a diesel, it's an engine. We live in a confusing world. And a lot of this stuff is just so hard to grasp or understand why people call things what they call them. But back in the day, like I was saying, when they first came out with the motor car, they called it, or the horse's carriage. It wasn't an engine car. It was a motor car. So I think by all of this right here, it is fine for you to call this a motor. Or, it is fine for you to call this right here an engine. I don't think, personally, that either one is wrong. It could be a motor. It could be an engine. But I do want you guys to hit me up in the comments, like I was saying. Give me your thoughts on this. Just let me know what you're thinking about. It. Is this a motor to you, or is this an engine? And like I said, it's possibly, could be just where you come from as to what you call it. But around here in the country... This has always been a motor. Anybody hardly ever says engine. So I personally, I think you're right either which way. It could be a gas burning motor or it could be a gas burning engine. But like I said, hit me up in the comments. Let me know. I think this is going to be a sensational comment section here going on with this. This is just something that come up in my other video, like I said. And people that were saying motors, other people were saying they was wrong. They was not a motor. It was an engine. So I just thought I would do a little more investigating on 
technically what it could be called or should be called. And But what I've came up with, like I said, this is a motor and this is also an engine. Just whichever one you want to call it. It's kind of the tomato, tomato, potato, potato kind of thing there. So hit me up, guys, in the comments. Let me know what you think. Hope everybody's having a sensational day.